<laughs> What'd you do? I don't know. What's up, P Nation? Today we're in Kosice, Slovakia. This is our 27th country. We are so excited to be here. We're gonna start the day off by going to get Nutella pancakes. I'm so excited. <laughs> I don't know if that's like an actual Slovakian thing, but yeah. we saw it on um, YouTube. It's like a challenge. And so we were like, let's just go try out these pancakes because we haven't had pancakes since yeah. we've been on the road. And they look amazing and we're pretty darn excited. And then after that, we're going to explore the old town. But first, mm -hmm. we're going to walk through to get the pancakes. happening this Saturday morning. We've already found a wedding. It is one o'clock in the morning. We even got to see the bride. Not one o'clock in the morning. <laughs> one o'clock in the afternoon. But yeah, we just saw the bride. Everyone's so happy. It's just amazing here. We did, this was, wasn't really on our plans until like a week ago to come yeah. to this country. And we are so glad we did. Bistro and apparently like this is where the locals hang out. We originally came here to get this like 15 stack Nutella pancake thing that we saw on YouTube but apparently they don't have it anymore. So oh well. We're still getting pancakes here. It's gonna be really good because they're gonna be some of the Nutella. And we got this fruit smoothie with mint. Well it's like fruit with no sugar and it's just like herbs completely opposite of anything we've ever had in Thailand or in Southeast Asia. It's just like there you put fruit and sugar in it. Here it's like fruit, no sugar, and mint and herbs. Like I'm tasting like oregano too. I don't know what's going on. So we did get the small stack of pancakes. And pancakes are a Slovakian thing, however they're more like crepes. These are nice and fluffy, so we're pretty excited because we haven't had pancakes. And we used to make pancakes at our apartment all the time. Whoa. This looks intense. Though. Mm. Mm. They're warm, they're super gooey, and they're actually kind of like crispy on the outside. That is like an interdimensional experience. <coughs> That was so good and so sweet. And now we're headed back into the old town to explore this. I mean, when was it created? I think it was the 1600s when this town really got established. It's also very interesting, we're here in the old town now, that no one is out on a Saturday. We just came from Costas, which was like, we're in Costas. Just came from Kokao, the other K town, and where it's like everyone is out all the time. Maybe everything's closed on Saturdays here, but it's just kind of eerie walking through this desolate. It's nice though. Yeah. Like I feel like this is a hidden gem, but it's like clearly not. Like it's beautiful. There's just not a lot of people right here right now. have made it to the old town where all the tourists are, everyone's sitting out, and it's such a relaxing day. Was it like 70 degrees Fahrenheit here? It feels beautiful. I don't know. It feels, I mean, yeah, it's like between 70 degrees. It feels just like a mountain town. It's it drier. Nice. Yeah. This and is it's beautiful. And there are flowers out. You know? Like it's, I feel like spring has just ended here and like it just became summer. And all the flowers are still in bloom. It's just like a very nice, relaxing place. Mm -hmm.
Okay, and we were in the old town and we just went in the church and there's like another wedding. It's like the third wedding today. And people keep arriving in like dressed up clothes. So I don't think they're late to this one. I think they're going to the next one. So they All might right. have like 10 weddings today. It's crazy. And it was really weird that we were like allowed to go in there. You could definitely tell people were just visiting, just like to see, like witness it for a little while yeah, they were singing, and walk away. Yeah. It was really weird. <laughs> Okay, so we made it to the border of the old town and there's a triathlon today. There's like all these people on bikes yeah. and they're running and everyone's clapping everywhere. It's so much fun. We have, we know nothing about triathlons. So we actually had to like stop and ask. We were like, is it swimming and then biking? And they're like, uh-huh. Then <laughs> running, yes, got it right. <laughs> very nice, very nice. Don't look at me, I'm working on my fitness. <laughs> back out in it last time you guys saw us was about two and a half hours ago we just had a gigantic meal and now we're looking for the nightlife of the city Here. No. And I'm so happy that we're here. Yeah. Do people on Rick Steve's know they're on Rick Steve's? You should come here too. 